Hi guys, I'm Mew, and welcome to another video, but this is a different video. As you can see, I have a couple of stuffed animals left on my bed. Um, uh, I have them all in a line, and so I'm going to do a little video about my first and favorite stuffed animals. So, pretty much, I can't remember who I what the first stuffed animal I ever got was, but one of the ones I've had for the longest time that I can remember is Big Kitty. And I sleep with him every single night, and everyone else, all the other stuffed animals, like, sleep at the head of my bed. And so, like, I cannot give away my stuffed animals, I can't give them to Mimi, I just love them too much. So this is, I'm just going to be explaining my first and favorite stuffed animals that I've ever gotten. So, first one is... Big Kitty. Big Kitty is my, is a, um, it's like, it's pretty much as old as me. I got him when I was three months old. I got him when I was three months old, and, like, his name has changed throughout my, through my childhood. His first name was Kitty Kitty, who, and, and that time he was a girl, apparently, and then, um, he turned into Kitty, and then he turned into Big Kitty after I got, and he was, he became, like, um, lovey-dovey with the stuffed animal, Mama Kitty. And Mama Kitty is a, um, Build-A-Bear. I love Build-A-Bears, like, I'm, pr I'm, I'm almost a teenager, and I still am in love with stuffed animals. Like, every night I just have to look through my stuffed animals to make sure they're still alive and stuff. But, um, Mama Kitty is a Build-A-Bear that I remember getting when I... It's one of my earlier memories when I could remember when I first learned how to walk, I think. Maybe not. I think I was able to talk to. Like, I was able to walk and talk. So I was pretty... I was pretty... Like, I was probably probably four or something and as you can tell she's pretty old mama kitty ha has been through a lot she's kind of dirty but i love her always and if maybe you guys have the stuffed animal too if you have if you have a build a bear exception like i have like a million more like i don't even know where they all are like i have a bunch of build a bear birth certificates i just love stuffed animals so much and build bears and stuff so i think um i can't remember i don't know what i should do next i think i'll do easter puppy and easter puppy is a stuffed animal that i got on on during an easter um during, and he, I think he was in my, one of my baskets, I don't remember getting him, I just remember having him since I was little, and he was, um, and he, he came with, like, little, a little bunny ear, like, headband thing, to make him, which made me want to call him Easter Puppy, like, Easter Bunny, so I love Easter Puppy, he is really cute and stuff. He's a chihuahua, but he kind of has red eyes. Like, he's really cute. I love him. And as you can see, he has a butt nose. And that is because my dog, Plato, had an obsession with chewing off noses of my stuffed animals. And luckily, no one was like torn apart. None of my stuffed animals were torn apart. They just all were missing noses, like this one. So, my mom and my, my mom and grandma had to get, get little, like, little noses for them. And I think this one suits him. I mean, it's pretty cute and stuff. So, that is Easter Puppy. Oh, big kitty, don't fall. Um, we're doing a video. Stay up straight. So, I will just do my little poodle next, who is named White Puppy. I was very creative with these names when I was little. I was wasn't I, or weren't I, I don't know what the proper grammar is, I'm so bad, sorry, um, <clears throat> this is White Puppy, and White Puppy is a, is a, um, stuffed animal that I've had for a long, long time, and, um, actually, one of the eyes don't, ma aren't, 
don't match because when my dog Pla no not my dog Plato it was before I had Plato I was like I think I might have been like three or two or something maybe three because I could talk and walk I can't remember anything I'm sorry um but her eye fell out and so I had to give her a button eye but then I got um then I got safety eyes and so I was able to put the eye in okay so Next up is Brown Kitty. Very original names are very original names, aren't they? Um, I'm going to move the camera a little bit. This is Brown Kitty, and Bra I can't even remember everything from Bat Brown Kitty. All I know is that I got him when I was really young, like almost all of my other stuffed animals. And he, I just, he's one of my favorite stuffed animals. He's all floppy and cute, and like he has little. Um, beans in him, which I, I think makes him extra cuddly, and one time I had a weird dream where he could fly, he could float, and he had purple spots, so I had a really weird imagination when I was a kid, so, um, next I think should be my little puppy Alaska, and this is a stuffed animal that I got from my, I think, uh, was it my great aunt? I'm pretty sure it was, I'm pretty sure Alaska came from my great aunt who went to Alaska and brought back Alaska, I got guess, from like a souvenir shop. It's re Alaska, he's really, really old and um, as you can see, my dog decided that it, his nose was tasty too. I re I'm really, bleh, I cannot speak. I'm really glad my other dog, Lily, didn't doesn't chew all my stuffed animals up because ugh, all the buttons we'd have to get but luckily we got safety noses not too long ago and i made a present for my like third or second baby cousin but that's a story for another day um alaska is a little husky stuffed animal i love him so much um, he's actually my dad's favorite stuffed animal out of all of mine. I don't know why I added that random fact in there, but he's cute, small, and I love him, and he fits into my hand like this. Like, when I was little, like, I was, like, Big Kitty, like, okay, I'm gonna talk about Big Kitty a little bit more. When I was a baby, and my parents were at a store, they, they saw Big Kitty on a shelf, and she, he, they would stick it in my face, and I would absolutely love it, and it was a perfect size, because it was in my, like, I was in my, like, carrier when I, at the time, when I was, like, really, really young, and it fit perfectly for me to hug him and touch his face, uh, this is completely quoting from my, what my parents said, and apparently I just loved him, fell in love with at the first sight, so I, so I've loved him ever since, and I can, and I can't even sleep without him. So, next is Baby Kitty, and Baby Kitty is, um, a Baby Kitty, as you can see, that I, it, I think it looks a lot like a Mew. I just realized, Baby Kitty, you look a lot like a Mew. Oh my gosh. How crazy is that? <laughs> I didn't even want to, I didn't even know what YouTube was when I, even, when I got this guy. And, um, and Baby Kitty is a, um, little, um, um, little, like, I don't even know what stuffed animal it is, but it feels really a lot like felt, and, like, her eyes aren't really, aren't, like, safety eyes, it's, like, sewn on, and she has, like, little furry whiskers, and I got her from, like, you know those fishing games where they, you put, like, there's, like, there's a little wall, and then you have a pole with the strings on them? And then they would, like, attach things to those strings, and, like, and stuff. This is where I got, that's where I got her from. So, that is pretty much a quick little sum up. And we're not so quick, it's, like, probably ten minutes long. I, so imagine if I tried doing all of my stuffed animals, oh my gosh, that would be, able, that would never end. So, um, that is pretty much all of my stuffed animals. Those are my... These are my first and favorites, and there are even more first and favorites, I just didn't want to put them in the video, because this is, these are like, this is like the original mix, like, I had, when I was little, I had like, 
an entire mountain of stuffed animals, like, on the side of my bed, and, like, I was, I was so, I couldn't sleep very well because stuffed animals were, were all over my bed, and so I put, and so I had put, like, baskets on the other side of my bed to, like, put them in, and finally, I think this, this way over here is the best way, which is just, like, a little area where I put some of my favorite stuffed animals, so, I think that's, that about sums it up. If you want me to do some more of these, please comment down below. And, um, and I hope you enjoyed this video with me so much that you looked at this video and pressed, like, watch or something like that. Um, oh, I think I'm gonna sneeze or something. So, remember to love the lovers and love the haters. I love you and so do all of my stuffed animals. Bye!